Hey everybody, it's Sammy Nikki. So today I decided I would review the Doodles in Outer Space um, coloring book. Um, first of all, I just want to say I did change my channel name. It was Jellyfish Star Studios, but now it's Sammy Nikki, and I'm just gonna leave it at that just because I change it all the time, and so I'm just gonna leave it at that because it's my name. So I'm just gonna leave it. Um, but yeah, so. This coloring book is literally my favorite coloring book of all time. Um, it's, I believe it was around $6. I got it for Christmas. Um, we got it off Amazon because I had put, I had went on Amazon and made like a virtual wish list or whatever. And I had gotten this for Christmas and it's so cool. Um, in this I use Ohuhu markers. Um, and they work pretty well. They do kind of bleed since it's not marker paper. So you have to be kind of careful when you're, um, coloring. But then, um, like this, I used Prismacolor. Let's see, I don't think it's going to focus, but I used Prismacolor pencils on this. And the rest is Ohuhu markers just because this didn't work very well, so I just didn't use pencils ever again in this book. Um, so I'm just going to show you a couple of the pages that I've colored. And the other thing is it bleeds through on the back. So I just took three sheets. I have three sheets of paper here. This like, it's just cheap, uh, like printer paper, I guess. And I put that behind there and I, um, just use the same one. I have three just in case it bleeds through this one and it really hasn't. So that's pretty good. But, um, yeah, there are so many cool ones in here. I'm just going to show you the pages that I've colored, and then I will show you um, the um, a couple uncolored pages. Is What I really like is it doesn't have fine lines, and it has a lot of really weird characters, and I love that. So, like, this is a food-themed page, and then... Here's this. I'm, I'm going to be doing a review on the Ohuhu markers as well. And here's like a cereal box. I can't really see it. Pouring, uh, I would, I was about to say food, but <laughs> it's not food. Um, and then here is basically the, like, the, the page that I'm on now. I haven't finished coloring it yet. But then I'll just give you, um, I'll just show you a few uncolored pages just so that you guys get an idea of some of the things. So these pages are kind of like filler pages, I guess, or like, I don't know, like they just have like stuff in them, like it's not an actual scene. There's, um, probably three or four of those in here, um, probably only like three, and the rest of them are, um uh, normal, uh, like, ones like these, where it's not just items placed like that. I don't know. Um, yeah, I guess they would be called, like, pattern pages or something. But, yeah, overall, like, the paper is kind of thin, but the pages are, like, only one-sided, so then you don't have to worry about choosing which side you're going to color over, I guess. So that's really cool. Um, honestly, I, I love this book. I'm obsessed with this book. I would recommend this to anyone. Like, there's no age on it, I don't think. But I would recommend this anyone ages like 10 and up, maybe? I don't know. Um, if you're going to be using alcohol markers, it should definitely be an older child. But if you're using colored pencils, then I would say a little bit younger. But, yeah, overall, I love this. 10 out of 10 recommend this. If I can figure out how and remember how, or, like, remember the stuff or whatever, I will link this in the description box down below so that you can easily click that and find it. Um, I think that's about it. Um, I'm also going to try to put my Redbubble shop link down below, so if you want to buy anything off there you can. Um, yeah, so make sure to 
like, comment, subscribe if you have any videos idea, video ideas for me or anything. Um, leave them in the comments down below. And I think that's about it. So, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, that's that's it. I'm I'm sorry. I'm I'm bad at this. <laughs> Bye.